Hello guys, KP Shambino here with a new video for Fishing Planet. And yesterday they released uh, a lot of info about the fisherman, so the release date, all that stuff. So what did I do yesterday and today? I gathered three and a half papers. They are small papers, I need to say. Uh, with all the info that I found on the Facebook, uh, uh, I was searching a little bit around too on the, the website of the publisher because Big Ben is the publisher. So the publisher published the game, asked money for it, is going to uh, put it to the stores. And Fishing Planet is now making the game. So in the past, Fishing Planet was the publisher, uh, but now it's different. So uh, yeah, it's a little bit a different uh, mechanic how they are going to do it. So first of all, before we start, uh, always remember it's two different games. It's not really different games because a fisherman is fishing planet, but you need to see it as different games. So uh, I know a lot of people think it's just the same game. It's the same game because the what, what is in the game is just the same. I know it, but you need to see it like two different games. Uh, so yeah, let's get started. So first of all, I started to uh, search around on the, the internet uh, about the price. So I only found one shop uh, that or one store that is selling it at the moment and they are asking 65 euros for it. Uh, so that was the only shop. I went to uh, Big Ben, their, uh, their sh uh, shop, uh, but I didn't found it. It's very strange that they make a trailer, but you cannot pre-order it right away. Uh, but there are some stuff in the video too that uh, are not that well executed. I will say why that is uh, a little bit later. So at the moment I only got one shop, but I think the price, the price range is going to be that. Uh, between, let's say, 50 euros to maybe 70 euros, I think that's going to be the price range. That's a lot of money. You need to say it like this, that's a lot of money. Uh, but yeah, you are going to get a lot of stuff in the Fisherman too. Uh, so, uh, but yeah, let's get started. Then the other one, uh, you can get it on all three platforms. That's PS4, uh, Xbox One and uh, PC. On Steam, I didn't found it yet. So I think they still need to update it. Uh, so uh, yeah, we need to wait a little bit. It will be released the 17th of October. So that's still one and a half month to go. And what is in the Fisherman? So first of all, uh, you guys can see it in the trailer. Uh, there are 35 DLCs in it. I think they just put all the DLCs from Fishing Planet uh, in the Fisherman. Uh, we are going to get exclusive content. I'm not sure what they mean with it, because that was the first strange thing that I saw. So you guys can see here the exclusive content. So that's friends, that's a new lake, uh, that's trolling, that are four new species and that are boats. But I don't understand it really well. Uh, so we are not going to get it in the free to play fishing planet. Uh, so I don't know that. Uh, I think they are going to put it in the free to play, but I don't think that they are going to release it before the fisherman is live. Otherwise, it's not not exclusive. Uh, because if you put it now in fishing planet and in month uh, one month and a half later, you put friends in uh, in the fisherman. Yeah, it's not exclusive. So I don't know that. I think at the end they are going to put it in the free to play uh, game, but I think it's going to be after the fisherman is released because that's logic. Uh, so, but that's exclusive content. So it's not 18 lakes, it's 19 lakes that you got in the Fisherman. So the lakes are just the same because I counted the lakes in Fishing Planet and they are just the same. We got 18 in the free to play, the Fishing Planet, and 18 plus friends in the Fisherman. So that's the exclusive content what I saw in the, in the video. So that's a little bit the how you can sell a game so you just say this and this and this is all in the, the new game. Uh, it's a lot because 35 DLCs, that's a lot of gear that you get at level one. Uh, so uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's the selling point uh, to attract uh, people to buy the game. But then we are going to the mechanic and economy point. And for the guys that play Fishing Planet for a long time, everybody knows that it's always min-maxing. Uh, you, you most of the time you just fish, not because you want to fish or enjoy fishing. No, you fish for money. So you just uh, always need to pay a lot of stuff, repairs, 
travel fees, license. If you do competitions, uh, yeah, you need to pay so much money. So the free to play fishing planet economy wise was not good. Uh, it, it was, yeah, it's a free to play game, uh, but still. It, it was, in my opinion, it was very hard. And I think two years ago or something, or one and a half years ago, when Louisiana came and a new level system game, uh, they put the, the travel fees very, very high. Uh, to give you guys an example, yesterday I went to Aktuba for the EIT competition and I need to pay around 20,000 currency. I never can make that money back uh, because uh, yeah, EIT is not paying that much. So... You always need to have premium on two most of the time if you don't have the time. So it was very hard. Everybody knows that. But in the fisherman, they they solved those problems. I need to say it how it is. Those problems are gone. So the store items are just the same. But then we come to the economy. So fish going to give more credits and the unique fish are going to give bait coins again. Uh, so for the guys that played the game a long time, at the start of Fishing Planet, every unique fish gave bait coins. Therefore, the old players got so many bait coins. Uh, so uh, it was insane. And those days, getting a unique was very, very easy. It's still very easy. But uh, to give you guys an example, I still remember the unique butterfly. I think we had 20, 25 every fishing day. So that's 25 bait coins uh, every day. Uh, I'm not sure that they already were called paid coins on that moment. Uh, I think it was just gold currency. Uh, but that was how it was at the start. And now it's just the same in the Fisherman. Then another thing. Uh, the license going to be only unlimited license. And you can buy them with credits in the Fisherman. So... Uh, yeah, now you need to pay bait coins to get unlimited license. Then the travel price is lowered. That's one of the, the very uh, consuming uh, money taking part in Fishing Planet. That was a very nice sentence that I made there. Uh, no microtransactions anymore and no payment to skip the time. So if you want to skip now the time and your cooldown is still up, you need to pay one bait coin. So that's a lot of uh, bait coins that you need to pay because your cooldown can go to 45 minutes. But if your net is full and you're a level 50, uh, yeah, you need to pay a bait coin. If you want to practice for tournaments, competitions, you need to use a lot of bait coins. That's gone. I cannot really understand why they still keep bait coins in the Fisherman. Uh, because for what are you going to use them? <laughs> because the unlimited license is currency normal. Uh, the... The, the payment for skipping is gone. So you're only going to pay bait coins for gear, I think. So not sure. I think they can just remove it. I'm not really sure why they yeah, not just removed it. Because, okay, you can use bait coins for gear that is a little bit higher than your level at the moment in the shop. You can do that. But you got 35 DLCs too. So... You got a shitload of gear at the start at level 1. You got a big net, you got big equipment. You all can use that equipment. Uh, so not sure why you still need to have bait coins. Maybe there is a mechanic that you can use them for. I don't know. Uh, but at the moment, I don't know it. I think they can just uh, remove it. Another thing that I don't understand, no microtransactions. So uh, if you watch the video, so at the start of the video, you see premium at the top. Uh, for me, premium is a microtransaction. I always thought that. Uh, so, I think they did, a, they did a mistake in editing the video. Because now you guys can see it. Uh, at the start of the video, you see premium at the top and at the end. I think that's the fisherman and the start is fishing planet. You don't see the premium anymore. Uh, I think we are coming now to the, to the point in the video. So, let's have a look. You guys will see right away what I mean with it. So here at the top, you see premium. It's now active. You can see it at the top. And then the if we go to the exclusive content, and I think on that moment they are in the Fisherman game, the premium is gone. So I cannot answer it. I don't think that you can buy premium in the Fisherman. Uh, I think it would be not a wise plan to do that. But yeah, you don't know. At the moment, I can only see what the video is saying. So... Then for the guys, then we come to the tough part, uh, the tough part, the, the hard part, I need to say. Uh, so I was uh, debating with myself a long time because the first 
time that I saw this, that was yesterday, I was like, yeah, I'm never going to buy this. I put 4,000 hours in Fishing Planet. Uh, but then I saw what is in the Fisherman, and I think I'm going to do it. Because I, I try to keep uh, a premium the whole time up. So premium for one year is like uh, almost 60 euros too. Uh, but you still got the bad economy. You got the, the everything is way too overpriced. Uh, and the fishermen don't have that anymore. Uh, so I think that, that I'm going to buy the fisherman. If you got, of course, uh, all the DLCs, it's going to be a lot harder. But yeah. It, it's still, the mechanic is a lot better. You need to say it how it is. I always, uh, yeah, thought by myself, I buy one, two DLCs. So on 4,000 hours, I only bought like one or two DLCs. Why? Because that's 80 euros. For me, 80 euros, that's more than enough for a fishing game. That are two AAA games. You can say, okay, Shamin, you played a long time uh, the fishing plan. That's true, but I paid premium too. Uh, so I think that's, more than enough for a game, for a fishing game like this. Uh, but for the guys that got a lot of DLCs, it's going to be a very hard debate with herself. Uh, because, yeah, are you going to do it for the player friendly only? I think at the end you are going to do it. Uh, I don't think that they are going to give a chance to put the progress from Fishing Planet to uh, the Fisherman. No, it's not going to happen. It, it are two different games. What I found too is they are keep uh, supporting the free-to-play game too. They said that. Uh, so I'm not sure in what extension that they are going to do it. Because now you got a game that is... The Fisherman is now finished. This is a game that you buy in the store, you play it, it's finished. It's not a free-to-play game anymore. So I'm not sure how they are going to do it. They say that they are going to keep supporting it. But you guys know now too, what did we have this year? We got motorboats and we got the UK lake. It's now almost uh, September already. Uh, so content wise, we didn't have a lot of content this year. A lot of people uh, yeah, know that you saw. After, after the UK, you saw a lot of people coming back uh, to the game. You see now it decrease again. Because I think they were working on the fisherman most of the time. And uh, what I see now, I think I was right. So uh, another question that a lot of players ask. Uh, do you need to start over? Yes, you need to start over because it's a new game. Uh, it's uh, back from zero. Uh, but I think with all the DLCs, it's not going to take that long. Uh, so, yeah, uh, yeah, I cannot say more, guys. So it's, uh, yeah, I know a lot of people, uh, yeah, it's, it's hard for old timers, I think, because uh, I can understand we put a lot of time in it, uh, a lot of money in it. And uh, now you need to do one time more. You need to pay money. Uh, I know that. But, uh, but at the end, I think the fisherman is going to be... Uh, the, the place to be. I think most players uh, in this and a year are going to be on the Fisherman. That's what I'm thinking. Because it's, uh, it's the, the content in the Fisherman is way better than in Fishing Plant. You need to say it as it is. Uh, so, uh, yeah. I cannot do a lot about it, guys. So you need to decide for yourself. Are you going to pay it again? Uh, or, or are you going to stay on Fishing Planet? So everybody can decide it. I think the two, the two games are going to stay. Uh, they set it, so I believe them. But at the end, we need to wait a little bit. You never know in game development. You never know. Uh, so uh, I can only give you guys the info. So thanks for watching, guys. Have fun. And I see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.